Welcome to this CLSI document overview presentation on CLSI VET 01S Performance Standards for Antimicrobial Disc and Dilution Susceptibility Tests for Bacteria Isolated from Animals. Let's learn more about this document. VET 01S can help your laboratory by providing the currently available veterinary specific breakpoints developed and approved by the CLSI Subcommittee on Veterinary Antimicrobial Susceptibility Testing. How to interpret antimicrobial susceptibility test results using tables with updated nomenclature and the most current veterinary specific breakpoints with tables reorganized based on user input. How to report antimicrobial susceptibility test results using newly approved breakpoints and how to support good antimicrobial stewardship by determining which antimicrobial agents should be considered for routine versus selective testing and reporting. VET 01S is continually revised providing veterinary diagnostic laboratories with updated information, including what's new in this fifth edition. Changes to Table 1, antimicrobial agents that could be considered for routine testing by veterinary microbiology laboratories, including test and report groups, groups A through E, updated to include a new group B category. Antimicrobial agents added corresponding to newly approved breakpoints. Antimicrobial agents listed in alphabetical order within each test and report group. And antimicrobial agents separated for dogs and cats. Additional new items in this fifth edition include changes to tables 2A through 2J, zone diameter and MIC breakpoints, including reorganized tables based on user feedback, first by animal species, then by alphabetical order of antimicrobial agents within each animal species. Table 2C, Zone and Diameter, and MIC breakpoints for Staphylococcus species is now divided into separate tables, Table 2C1 for beta-lactams and beta-lactam combination agents, and Table 2C2 for non-beta-lactams. The former tables 2D and 2E are now in reverse order, with Table 2D containing Zone Diameter and MIC breakpoints for Enterococcus species and Table 2D containing Zone Diameter and MIC breakpoints for Streptococcus species. Tables 2A through 2J are also updated with newly approved breakpoints. Canine-specific ceftazidine and levofloxacin breakpoints for Enterobacteriales and Pseudomonas aeruginosa. Feline-specific amoxicillin clavulinate breakpoints for E. coli. Equine-specific ampicillin breakpoints for Enterobacteriales and Staphylococcus aureus. Bovine-specific cephoparazone breakpoints for bovine mastitis pathogens, Enterobacteriales, Staph aureus, coagulase-negative Staphylococcus species, and several Streptococcus species. For more on what's new in VET 01S, users are referred to the detailed overview of changes in the CLSI supplement VET 01S. There is also an on-demand VET 01S webinar available on CLSI's Knowledge Builder e-learning system. VET 01S is continually revised, providing veterinary diagnostic laboratories with updated information with advantages of the best information available to clinicians as well as patients. These advantages include ensure more accurate and better performance of susceptibility testing of veterinary pathogens using standard methods, approved QC ranges, and updated breakpoints. Decrease reliance on human breakpoints, which may not predict clinical efficacy in animals. Provide access to antimicrobial agent dosage regimens used to establish veterinary-specific breakpoints, which may be provided to clinicians as additional data to assist them in interpreting results. VET 01S discusses some of the applications of veterinary antimicrobial susceptibility testing, including establishing QC ranges, breakpoints, and interpretive categories for the results of standard antimicrobial susceptibility tests performed on veterinary pathogens. Continually refining standards through development of new or revised methods, breakpoints, interpretive categories, and QC parameters, and educating users and fostering a dialogue with users of these methods and those who apply them. Using this supplement and its standard methods will enable the user to ensure reliable results that are comparable with those reported by other laboratories performing antimicrobial susceptibility testing on veterinary pathogens. VET 01S is intended to be used by veterinary diagnostic, research, public health, and other laboratories, manufacturers, and regulatory agencies and accrediting organizations, 
Although regulatory agencies do not set veterinary-specific breakpoints, and veterinary antimicrobial susceptibility testing equipment manufacturers do not have pre-approval or regulatory clearance requirements for use of commercial testing devices for veterinary isolates, those manufacturers are expected to validate their methods against CLSI reference methods. However, CLSI does not evaluate these data. VET-01S aids manufacturers in the development of testing devices that are clinically appropriate, as well as safe and effective for the intended use. It also provides guidance to pharmaceutical manufacturers for testing their products for veterinary application. CLSI appreciates your interest in our standards, guidelines, supplements, and reports. And thanks you for viewing this document overview presentation. Please visit our website at www.clsi.org.